Welcome to Thai Wandering with Jason. I am at the University of Illinois campus. This is where I spent my undergrad and grad school years. This is kind of my home away from home. And since I'm going back to Taiwan, I want to hit a bucket list of places that mean a lot to me. This obviously is one of them. I'm going to walk around campus, taking you to a bunch of places that are near and dear to me. I'm standing in front of the Illini Union building. This is the student union at the University of Illinois. And I'm actually staying at the hotel here. Uh, it's my first time staying here. The whole time that I was a student, I never did. I decided before I'm gonna leave, I might as well give it a shot. There are two beds and they have the Illini uh, pillows as well. And what's really neat is that there is a view of the quad. So I'm walking down the U of I quad, and as you can see, there's not a lot of people here. I mean, uh, part of it is because it is not time for the students yet. Uh, they don't come in until the 24th of August. But another thing too is because of COVID, and fewer people are around about. This is where I had a lot of my lectures. Uh, incidentally, it's also a concert hall. I actually saw one of my favorite artists, Ben Folds, perform at uh, Follinger. So it's kind of a neat thing. It doesn't happen all the time where your lecture hall can double up as a concert venue as well. I'm standing in front of the English building, and this is also where I spent a lot of time. Some people don't know this, but I was actually an English major and a history minor. It's a really pretty building, but they say that it's haunted. Apparently, this used to be a girl's dorm, and there was a swimming pool uh, down in the basement. And, and one morning, uh, I guess a girl went to, to swim, and she drowned. And so they say that her ghost actually haunts this building. This is where I learned how to become a teacher. And I had some excellent friends in our cohort that I still keep in touch with to this day. Fantastic professors as well too. Now one thing you're gonna notice right away is it is quite an ugly building. Uh, I actually call it the ugliest building on campus. This should have been my first sign that there isn't that much money in teaching. You know, you look at this building compared to the engineering building and those places are, <laughs> they're, they're beautiful, uh, they're spectacular. Uh, you can definitely tell where the money goes in, in this university. So sh that should have been my first sign. But had a lot of great experiences here at the education building. So here I am at Memorial Stadium. This is the home of the Fighting Illini football team. Now, I enjoy coming to games here, tailgating beforehand. When I was a student, we actually got to go see a few bowl games. They made it to the Micron PC Bowl in Miami. They also made it to the Sugar Bowl in New Orleans and the Rose Bowl in Pasadena. Unfortunately, uh, they kind of got blown out the last two games. But still a lot of fun to uh, hang out with my friends, uh, travel to those places, and see the Fighting Lion I play some football. Papa Dell's in Champagne. This is an institution here. I'm grabbing some of their deep dish pizza. Now, I know I recently went to to Pequod's and I really love that pizza a lot too, but uh, Papa Dell's is a little bit different. Sausage is a lot bigger over here. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, this takes me back to my college days of eating here. They do have a new location since I went to school, and it's actually really nice. Uh, very new and airy as well, too.
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, twenty-two. Okay, that was for you, Dana. Go by nice.